it's the day that they're announcing where everybody's going and they go through every one of us in that company. They say our name and where we're going next. And they got to Jim McLuhan. Uh, they got to Private James McLuhan, Southeast Asia, Vietnam. And I'm thinking, he's, he must have been wrong. I, he, he's got to be wrong. I'm, I'm staying here. So they got all the way through it and I walked up to the company commander there and I said, sir, I said, um, you said James McLuhan was going to Vietnam. I think I'm staying here. And he looked at me and he, he knew. I didn't know he knew, but he knew. He said, I'm sorry, Private, but a regular Army man wanted your job. You're a draftee and he got it. You're going to Vietnam. So I'm, I'm disappointed at that particular point. Things just went on and, okay, this is what I'm going to do. And, and I got right into the right frame of mind that I will serve my country. I didn't volunteer to do it, but they've asked me to do it. So that's what I'll do. So I became Charlie Company's second platoon medic and went out to the field on the 9th of March, 1969. I, I got uh, initiated the very first day. We hit our amb first ambush, had a man die, had a few people to patch up, and I shot a man. That's a lot to digest in your first day of knowing where you're at now and, and what you're going to be facing. But I didn't know I was going to face anything like Tam Key and LZ East, which were two of the big, big battles that I faced.